the sarcophagus. This was the coffin where the pharaoh would finally be laid to rest. Carved from a solid block of granite or quartzite, a royal sarcophagus could weigh up to 10 tons. With the sarcophagus in place, the tomb was complete. What had begun as a cavern dug out of the bare rock had been crafted into a finely tuned vehicle for transporting the deceased to the afterlife. It was now ready for its royal passenger, the mummy of the pharaoh. The body of the dead pharaoh, Seti I, is almost ready for his journey to the afterlife. After his body has been disemboweled and dehydrated, all that remains is for him to be wrapped in the finest linen. The wrapping goes on for days and days on end, and in the mummy wrappings they insert, in very specific places, a number of amulets. To the Egyptians, amulets had magical powers. The Ankh was one of the most important of these. It would guarantee Seti eternal life. More than 150 amulets would originally have been placed among his bandages. You will have a set of little steps so that he can climb up to heaven. You will have a tiny little headrest so that the head of the king will always be upright.